Welcome everybody, this is your boy Joanna Matoro and we are here with another video. Like always, if you like this video, smash the like button and if you're new here, subscribe for more content and we're going to get straight into the video. Welcome back everybody, before we do get straight into the video, I would like to give a big shout out and thank you to the supporters of this YouTube channel. A big shout out to CrazyBossV31 and even Weez GNZ Gaming. Now these people are our YouTube members on our YouTube platform and I would like to give a big shout out and thank you for their support. So why don't you go inside my description below and go and check them out and we're going to get straight into the video. Now this video is all about on how to install your Sims 4 custom female pads inside your Grand Theft Auto V folder. So like always, make sure that you download and install all of the latest requirements. Once you have completed that, then download this mod and I will leave this mod inside my description below. So make sure that you download this mod. Now this mod does require another mod. So make sure that you go inside my description below and download add-on pens and I will leave this mod inside my description below. Next, download pet selector and I will leave this inside my description as well. So make sure that you guys do download all three mods and now let's get straight into it. Once you have completed that, then all you gotta do is go to your Creative Audio V game hover over it, right click and open file location. As you can see, I have already installed my requirements. So make sure that you do install your requirements first. Go to your mods folder, go to your update folder, go to your time 64 folder, and now go to your DRC packs folder. Now go to your add on peds extract folder, and now inside that folder, all you got to do is go to your DRC packs folder. Now select your add on peds folder and drag it inside your DRC packs folder. Go back to your extract folder and now go to your main folder. Now, next, all you got to do is go back to your Creative Audio V game folder and now. Go back to your extract folder and then go and select your add on peds editor.exe and add on peds vars.xml files and drag them both inside your Creative Audio V main folder. Now, next, go to your readme.html and then scroll down until you see underline number three make sure that you do copy this okay copy the DRC packs code and now next open up your open IV then now go to your creative audio V windows this process will take a few seconds once your application is open go to edit mode select yes Go to your mods folder, go to your update folder, go to your update.rpf folder, go to your common folder, go to data, then scroll right down to the bottom until you see drclist.xml. Hover over it, right click and select edit. Scroll right down and then now just select to your item. Go back, go back on your keyboard, press enter, and now place your code right there. Now, save your code, go back to your drclist.xml file, double click, and now double check to see if it's saved. Yes, it is. Now, exit out of your application, and now go back to your GTA V. Now, just minimize this, because we will be going back inside here after. Now next, open up your Pete Selector Extract Folder. And then now, go back to your Creative Auto V main folder. 
and then go to your scripts folder over here now make sure that you do have a scripts folder and make sure that you do spell scripts correct and make sure that it is all lowercase open up your scripts folder now next make sure that you do have the latest native ui dll file and even xml file make sure that they are both the latest version now go back to your extract folder and now all you've got to do is select your peer selector.dll file and drag it inside your scripts folder that's all you've got to do now go back to your creative audio v main folder then go, go back to your extract folder and exit out of your extract folder now we have finished completing installing add-on pairs now next we are going to be installing the sims 4 female paired mod now to install this mod we got two pairs one pair is lana and the other one is called samantha we are going to be installing the both of them okay now to install them both all you got to do is go back to your open iv now go to your mods folder go to your update folder go to time 64 go to your drc packs folder go to your add-on peds folder go to your drc.rpf then go to your peds.rpf and now all you got to do is go back to your extract folder and I open up your lana folder and I select all the files and then drag it inside your open iv exit out of your lana folder and now open up your samantha folder select all of the files that's inside that folder and then drag it inside your open iv now all you got to do next okay is exit out of your extract folder then now go to your edit mode go to gta v now exit out of your open iv now next okay go to your add-on page editor dot exe right click and now run as administrator now once it is open okay all you got to do is go to your peds drop down menu then go to new ped and now the model name is sam now next the peer type is female and is stream is false now select add peer now next we are going to install Alana. go down to your peers drop down menu now select new peer and now type Alana. next go down go down to peer type and select female then go to is streamed false and now select add paired now we have installed both of them now lastly go over here to rebuild and now select that button and then select ok now exit out of your add-on peds editor.exe now right click refresh your game folder exit out of your game folder right click refresh your desktop and now we finally installed add-on peds and even since for mod so i'll see you guys in the game and we are back with michael so what we are going to do is that we are going to go and actually uh change our bodies to samantha and lana so in order to open up your add-on pets menu all you got to do is press your l key then there you go now open up your add-on pets menu then go to either one of them and now all you got to do is select lana or samantha and now there you go so as you guys can see it does work now if you do have menu then you can have other outfits as well so let's go to menu and now let's go to uh play options and go to wardrobe then go to front view and now you can actually change the head uh, to whatever okay and change the hairstyle to whatever hairstyle you like hair color 
um, torso you can change it to a dress you can change the color and style of the dress like that um, and you can do it with the torso as well like that see and what else over here we got uh, the legs is the glasses you can give your character a glasses and we got other things in here but sound um, yeah so that is how you guys basically install and that's how you change your character and that's our character right now so I hope you guys do enjoy this mod and we're back again and now I hope you guys do enjoy the mod but like always if you guys do get stuck installing this mod then please let me know in the comments and I'll be more than welcome to help you out on that or if you do get stuck installing any other mods then please let me know in the comments and I'll be more than welcome to help you out on that so with that all said if you guys did enjoy this video then smash that like button and subscribe for more content and tutorials and I'll see you guys on my next video Thank you for watching. Peace and I'm out.